Hello, I'm Mary McCartney and I'm a photographer. I was asked this year to help design a t-shirt to celebrate 25 years of the Polar Music Prize. We had a meeting and explained a bit more of the history of it and what they wanted to do to celebrate it and um, I wanted to be part of it. When it came to the design of the t-shirt, um, I always had in mind that it would be a photograph and we kind of went back and forth trying out different designs. But in the end, um, we thought the strongest was one image that wraps around from the front to the back. And I also felt that black and white would have a lot of impact and be very wearable for clothing. It's a picture that I took backstage at a concert, I think a Morrissey concert, um, just before he went on. I love the guitars that are sort of um, stacked by the side of the stage. They're all lined up for the performance. So it's got a real live music feel to it, which I like. And it's a really nice soft cotton and it's unisex and it comes in lots of different sizes. So I kind of wanted it to be one design for everybody. So I think it works really well. Music, fashion and photography are pretty interlinked these days. I think before, you know, 20 or 30 years ago, music was music and rock and roll and a big show with lights, but now entertainers, musicians, singers, performers are very much involved in what they wear. The fashion is important, how it makes them feel, how it portrays their personality. I think the fact that my dad was one of the first Polar Music Prize laureates has sort of made me want to be more involved with the project. It made it more relevant to me and um, it's been a nice connection when I've been thinking about the images to use for the celebratory t-shirt. I think it's made me feel more connected and um, it's made more sense to me. The really interesting thing about Max Martin um, getting the prize this year is that his songs are very much the songs that would end up um, included in playlists when I'm doing a photo shoot and I, I wouldn't have even known it but that's what's really good about him as he gets to write all those songs and they're so huge and they make it into everybody's lives but he can still both stay very anonymous.